I am showing you how to open the M185 M555B and RX, RX1000 and how to fix them so briefly and one screw here for the M185 and then it's opened up this one doesn't have a battery in it so should be okay um, I'm presuming you have a small plastic here and here This is the main board. So what I've done is I've had a previous um, another mouse, an older, more dumber mouse, and I've extracted the clickers from it. As you can see here. These were here, so I took this part out. I didn't show how it's working and basically I'm going to replace the clicker on one and see how the time goes and replace the clip clicker on the second one so soldering iron and have some powerful nails here oh, either that or some screw driver flathead to open it up to force it out so hit every pin and at the same time pull it. It's probably gonna take you a while to pull it out because you have to heat up all pins at the same time somehow. But you have to be patient so probably easier with a flathead screw. I managed to open the other one without uh, any issues. Just using my nails. This is it, I managed to pull it out and this is the old one as you can see we've already replaced it once but it seems this one was busted anyway. So putting a new one, as you can see on the mouse board you have the position of it, the correct position. I think I wanted to use the other one. <coughs> and then you heat up all this again. So you don't break it. And then now it's in, but probably more of this stuff. So I don't know if you can just sell it here, just somewhere where it sits better.
And I've already done this for this mouse, so hopefully I didn't broke anything else, just this part. If you put too much of this, you can just uh, get rid of it. <sighs> it seems I put a bit too much here. So, this should wrap it up, I guess. New clicker added. This is one. I'm gonna put it back in the case. Second one. <coughs> is the RX1000. I'm not gonna do the M555B because I already have one and I've done this procedure and now it's working so I'm shy on opening it back up uh, because I'm afraid I'm gonna break it if I open it up too many times. So the RX1000 you have these stickers on it and this one seems to just fall off so they've been taken out several times maybe. This is basically the problem that not clicking correctly. You cannot double click or you cannot hold and drag. Drag you can not really use drag and draw for these mice. This is why I'm doing this, replacing the clicker. So I don't know if you've seen this part. I took all the screws out, the three screws, I took the stickers off, the screws off and then you have this part, you can put it here, you can reverse the process to assemble it back, then you have the cable, uh, might just be easier to push a little with the screwdriver on a side and then pull it gently so you don't break any cables, <coughs> and then I didn't use this part to take this off here so I'm presuming it's from the front haven't done this yet sorry <laughs> I have a screw here in front probably gonna fold the mouse wheel yeah and then you have the motherboard so you repeat the procedure Pay attention so you only replace the left mouse. Again, I use my nails because I didn't trim them for a while, but you can always use a flathead screwdriver. And Seems it's still recording. You have to be patient, patient. Otherwise, you'll break the motherboard or something. So, just easy. As long as you don't force it, it's gonna come outside. And there you have it, the second clicker. And I was keeping the other one. Again, you have the... You see, you have the drawing on the motherboard, saying, telling you exactly how to put it. Don't push it, because you're gonna break the motherboard. Keep it pressed, and at the same time heat up the pins. Sorry for my hand shaking and trembling. I'm trying to do this at a faster pace so you don't lose too much time on this. Ouch. It seems to have went all the way in and this pins seem to be shorter than the previous ones so 
I don't think that's an issue though. <coughs> and uh, again, use something to keep it pressed. <coughs> and then some more of this stuff. not to put too much seems I put a bit too much here but this is the second one, the RX 1000. Unfortunately, M55B uh, has a lot more screws in it, and I've already opened it up twice, so I'm afraid I'm gonna break it if I'm gonna open it. But you basically repeat the procedure. The problem is this one has like 10 screws in it, so the process is basically the same. But be very careful when you're opening it up because it has a lot of screws. Okay, hopefully, I'll <clears throat> Managed to put it back together. Let's not make screws here. And you have like two more screws here on the under these stickers So, basically careful, because you have another pin here. So, on this one, this is the problem that you have so many screws on it. Uh, you have two here. Um, you have one here. So, you take this part.